This method can help to answer key questions in the field of physical activity measurement about whether a visualization of different intensity levels can improve the accuracy of self-reported physical activity. The main advantage of this method is that it connects widely used communication techniques with the opportunity to achieve high-level standardization within a randomized controlled trial. Visual demonstration is critical as the combination of the questionnaire and the video represents an innovative approach to measuring physical activity difficult to describe adequately by written text. Demonstrating the procedure will be Margit Prostavik, a study assistant, and Elke Bandelin, a study nurse. Begin by selecting a publicly available or self-produced video based on the specific experimental question. Have the presenter in the video explain the differences in heart rate, breathing frequency, and ability to talk normally in accordance with the intensity levels. While simultaneously demonstrating these symptoms while walking or running on a treadmill at the corresponding pace. Then integrate the video into a self-administered tablet computer survey to be presented directly before the physical activity questionnaire, making sure the participants cannot skip the video. Recruit participants in a setting that permits enough time to hand out the accelerometer and to prepare the accelerometer for data collection. Obtain written consent from each participant prior to their participation. And select an accelerometer prepared at